And now to our Beyond special report. India is building more than 14,000 bunkers for families living along its border with Pakistan in Jammu and Kashmir state, hoping to keep them safe near their homes instead of uh, evacuating them as artillery shells scream overhead. Vyaz Nagin Singh made an attempt to understand the people living near the border and talk to some citizens on what they are facing. Here is a ground report. A village in the Araspura sector situated near Jammu. It is the last village in the sector and under the constant watch of Pakistani army outposts on the borders of India and Pakistan. Mortar shelling, cross-firing is a part of their daily lives. As tensions rise, India has been building bunkers to protect families along the border with Pakistan. With the shells piercing the walls of their houses, the lives of citizens who live in areas near the international border of India and Pakistan are constantly in grave danger. The government has started to build new bunkers to allay the fears of civilians who put their lives at risk even when they are within the four walls of their homes. Villagers on the Indian side of the border say that they were tired of fleeing their homes when outbreaks of firing erupt. Some have seen family members killed and the cost of leaving behind their cattle and crops is too heavy for many poor farmers. However, the village requires more bunkers built as soon as possible. तो यहां तक ये शेलिंग के दौरान ये ये बंकर की जरूरत पड़ती है और ये हमारे लिए बहुत ही सेफ है सरकार को इसकी तरफ ज्यादा तवज्जो देनी चाहिए और जहां जरूरत है और ये जल्दी बनने चाहिए इट इज अ क्वेश्चन ऑफ लाइफ एंड डेथ फॉर पीपल हु आर लिविंग इन दिस विलेज टू हैव बंकर्स लाइक दीस बिकॉज़ दीस आर द प्लेसेस वेयर पीपल हाइड व्हेन पाकिस्तानी आर्मी स्टार्ट शेलिंग इन द विलेज well there is a population of 1300 living in this village however there are only eight bunkers and they can accommodate only 200 people out here underground bunkers with their walls and roofs three times the thickness of a regular house in consuming 10 times as much steel have already been built haveli ram lambardar a frail 80 year old man from suchedgarh village says his son was killed in 2000 when he was hit by a bullet just outside their house which is surrounded by wheat fields near a watch tower bahut nuksan hota hai kis kis tarah ka nuksan fasalon ka nuksan hota hai pani nahi lagaya jata usko to baaki maal ko chara bhi nahi diya jata dekho jang to hota hai ladai to hoti hai लेकिन मारा तो सिमिल जाता है ना ऑन द पाकिस्तानी साइड ऑफ द बॉर्डर मोस्ट हाउसेस बिल्ट आफ्टर अ सीज फायर इन 2003 डू नॉट हैव बंकर्स अ नंबर ऑफ पीपल हैव बीन किल्ड एंड इंजर्ड बाय शेलिंग ऑन बोथ साइड्स इन रीसेंट डेज मेनी हैव फ्लेड फ्रॉम द बॉर्डर एरियाज दिस इज द लास्ट विलेज ऑन द बॉर्डर्स ऑफ इंडिया एंड पाकिस्तान इन द आरएसपुरा सेक्टर ऑफ जम्मू and indian air force has entered pakistan for the first time after 1971 and has killed more than 300 terrorists over there right behind me is pakistan and it's every day's routine that they retaliate and they cross fire in this area but it is the people of this village who suffer the extreme effects of it in india men and women in the sleepy jammu villages of suchedgar and pakistan close to the border fence are the first line of defense along the border as a matter of caution they stay indoors as much as possible with nagin singh in jammu rahul dalal for weon world is one